Y'all want to play with these people. You have to understand that something deeper is going on. There's a lot of rap beef happening, and I'm making diss tracks to all y'all because y'all being stupid. Like, this is deeper. Um, music is spiritual and it's political, but there is a war going on. A spiritual one right now, but it's getting real physical. Quavo is a killer. I know we don't think he is, but that diss track, he's, he's weak. He's, he's a weak rapper. He's trash. However, he was very serious. The artwork tells you a lot in everybody's music, actually. If you're paying attention to the cover work, the artwork, album, EP, single, whatever it is, you have to pray for discernment. But if you pay attention to what's going on, you see they're telling you a story. And it's a real one. It's not fake. This is how people get to let... Music or artwork is how people get to reveal who they are. They get to express themselves. These people are telling you who they are. They are setup chicks. J.I.D. is one too. And I got um I got a mixtape coming out against um Dreamville. Well, it's not really against Dreamville. It's for Dreamville. But he, J. Cole, he's being stupid. He got a, J. Cole has a bunch of wolves in his label. Everything he built, they're trying to ruin it. J.I.D., he's not for him. He says it through his art, through the cover work, through his music, through the songs that he sings with other people. The song he sang with um, Imagine Dragons called Enemy. He's his enemy. He's not for us. He says it in his um, tour the titles, the artwork, the Africans, and they hate us. They hate everything brown, people of color in America. They want to kill, steal, and destroy and ruin everything we built. Dream build, they're trying to ruin your dream. End of days, you need to wake up now. I speak about it. I haven't finished it, but there's some real stuff going on. And Dr. Dot, Olu's trying to take your whole flow. They're trying to get you out of there, just like they did to Nipsey. And they did to um, PMB Rock. They do it to all of us. They do it to all the sons of God, the real ones, the ones that are prophets that have a real message. So pay attention to what's going on. These rap beefs are, these rap beefs are not happening for no reason. They're happening because they're trying to cancel out the black culture, the real hip-hop, the real R&B. The real soul. They're trying to snatch y'all souls. Y'all talk about demons and fighting them, but they really are doing the most. They're trying to set you up. They're trying to ruin you. So pay attention and stop playing these with these dudes who are serious. Quavo is not playing with you. His song might be trash, but he's so serious. He wants to kill you. He wants to unalive you. He wants to ruin your whole career. He hates you. And I, I don't know what y'all got going on, but that's just what it is. And you're laughing about it, Chris Brown. You're playing. You're having fun because you are, are a playful child at heart, which is not bad. But you get caught up so much behind these toxic people, including the women. You got to wake up. You have a purpose. You're an influencer, but you're also very um, talented, gifted, and important. You, your music, your voice. Get back to the old one when you were 16, self-entitled. Get back to that forever, ever. Get back to that stuff because this new stuff, you're just being, being um, what is it, brainwashed. You're being a puppet and you're just being a slave doing all these things. Doing all these things. Are you really satisfied? Are you really happy?